Hi everyone, in this video I will be changing the grub background from this to this. The background can be changed to an image and it's easy to do. So going to help.ubuntu.com slash community slash grub2 slash displays and here it'll give some documentation of how to have it set up. And when choosing a grub2 background image, you can use PNG, JPEG, and TGA images for the background. And the image must meet the following specifications. JPEG images must be 8 bit, else you'll get an error saying too many Huffman tables. And number two, images should not be non index RGB. Three, the GIMP image editor is one application which can edit images to conform to the Grub2 standards. And I'm going to install GIMP so we can see the properties of images. And sample Grub2 splash images are contained in the Grub2 splash images package in the universe repository and they can be installed. So first I'm going to install GIMP, open up a terminal, and I'm going to sudo app get update first. All right, that's done. And now I'm going to install GIMP. Yes. All right, GIMP is installed. And now I'm going to install the grub2 splash images package, which has some splash images that we can use sudo app get install grub2 splash images. All right, it has been installed. Going back. And those images are under user share images grub. So I'm going to go into it. All right, and here are some images. And here's the image that I'm going to use, Tulip Stair Queen's House Greenwich. And I can confirm the properties of this image. I can go into GIMP. And go into that directory. And I can go into image, go into mode, and then we see it's RGB, so that's good. I'm going to close this. And installing the splash images, the method to include a background image in Grub2 varies depending on the version of Grub installed on the system. So I am going to check to see what version of Grub I have. And it'll be Grub installed V. And I have here version 2.06. And scrolling down, we have image priority and Grub 1.99 and later, how to put the background image. So first going to image priority. And if there's more than one suitable image that's available to Grub2, the following order is used to determine which image is used as the Grub2 background. So I'm going to go over the first two image priorities. So the Grub background setting in Etsy default Grub. And then the first image found in slash boot slash Grub. And the first image found in this order, JPEG, uppercase JPEG, lowercase JPEG, uppercase JPEG, PNG, uppercase PNG, TGA, and uppercase TGA. And if multiple images of the same extension, it's alphanumerically. Number two is the quickest, is to put the image under slash boot slash grub. So I'm going to do that. Pseudo copy the image. So it's under user share images grub. And it's tulip stair queen's house greenwich. Copy it to boot grub. Scrolling down. And we see here there's number one where you can set the setting. And number two is place a suitable image in the grub folder, which is what I'd done. And then afterwards, you run sudo update grub. And we see here it's found the background image, tulip stair queen's house greenwich. So that's good. And now I am going to reboot. All right, the image comes up as expected. So that's it. That's the quickest way of setting the background image in grub. I hope this video was useful and I thank you for watching. Bye now.